Guys, in this video, we'll see how to use WebAssembly in Flutter Web. Our sample website in Flutter Web. So, and let's click on this option, Vasm. You can see there is some description regarding WebAssembly and there are two buttons, Add and Multiply. The result on clicking of this button is basically fetched from the WebAssembly module which we have created and these functions, Add and Mult, are defined in that module. On the link WebAssembly.studio, select your choice of language, C or Rust. For this demo, we'll go with assembly script and hit on create. Open your main.ts file, define these two functions, add and mult, and hit on save. Getting the WASM module, we just click on build and run. It generates main.wasm file, and if we try to open this, this is the assembly language for these two functions, add and mult. Testing via JavaScript, we load the module using instantiate streaming and finally call our function mult with the parameters 3 and 3. Download this module by right clicking and download. We install the package wasm interop. We define a wasm contract which has the four options. Then we create a wasm loader which extends that contract. We override the initialize function by loading the module, wasm module from the assets as seen here. Compile the loaded wasm module using from buffer async which is from the package wasm interop. We override the call func by passing in the function name and the list of arguments. Internally it calls in the functions property and that functions property then finally calls in with the respective arguments. From our UI side, we load the asset from the assets directory and we initialize the VASM module. In the click of the button, we call addition and multiply functions. Functions basically call the function name add and mult, which are the ones which we just saw in our VASM module. That's it from this video. Thanks guys for watching and bye bye.